Well, he's an award-winning mind reader, wowing audiences all over the world. And he's back in his hometown for shows at the Chicago Magic Lounge. Welcome back, our good buddy, Mark Tolan. Hey, Mark. What's up, Mark? Good to see you again. It's so good to be back. Thanks for having me back. Always great to have you here. Tell people at home why you became a mind reader or how you discovered this gift. From a young age, I was drawn to this. From the age of three, I was into all sorts of things, magic and psychology and theater. I always needed to perform. But I was always drawn to the psychological side of, of magic. So that's really what it is. It's psychological illusions. It's mysteries of the mind. It's all audience participation. It's just super fun. I tell people all sorts of things, whether it's like a, a picture or more personal stuff, like a memory or a birthday or things like that. So. Yeah. Yeah, you're amazing at what you do oh, too. And this it. week, this week starting this week, you're gonna be at the Chicago Magic Lounge. Why is that spot so special? It's an amazing venue. So forever they've been doing shows kind of in a in a in a venue where they were renting and doing these shows. But then um, it took off so much they built their own venue up in Andersonville at 5050 North Clark. Oh yeah. And there's vintage magic memorabilia on the walls. There's secret passages, amazing 100-seat theater. And I'm the artist in resident on Wednesday alongside an additional six days of programming throughout the rest of the week. So, you know, if you like magic, if you want to get your mind blown, that's the place to go in Chicago. Yeah, could wow. you read Jesse Smollett's mind? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to mess with that. Yeah. 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 All right, show us what you're going to do today. Let's do it. Let's do it. So, Val, switch place over here. Okay. No problem. Um, let's play a guessing game. Okay. okay. Guessing game using these cups. We're going to space them out across the table like this. Okay. And uh, we're going to use this as well. This is a very sharp three, four inch spike. So Ryan, take a, take a press there. Be careful, All but right. confirm it's sharp. Yeah, it's sharp. Oh, yep. Ryan do that instead of you. Yeah, right? yes, okay, yes. so here's the game. I'm going to turn away. Val will cover my eyes okay. so I can't see. Okay. You hide the spike under any cup. You can mix them up if you want. It doesn't it. matter. Hide it. Keep them spaced like this so we have a nice uh, picture here. Okay. You cover my eyes. Let me okay. know when he's ready. You're not going to hashtag Once, me to me, are you? No, no, no. <laughs> Once we're good, I'm going to turn around and try to read your mind and guess where the spike is. Okay, okay? sounds okay. good. So I'll look oh, this okay. way. Cover my eyes. Okay. okay. So soft, so soft. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, no, no. You moisturize. I haven't been doing any work. You moisturize. No, this is good. This is good. Ryan, how you doing? You mixing it in there? Is it under a cup? Val? Yeah, doing great. He's doing, doing it. great. Can you Mark, see me? Doing great. I can't see a thing. There's okay. no monitor. Nope. Very important. Right. Okay. We good, Ryan? Yep, we're good. Okay, I'm gonna. Yeah, we're we good. Go. Okay, okay, put I your glasses back on. I can see the. Okay. 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 It's good. Okay, yep, good. Yep. So let's number the cups. You know where it is right yep, now? Yep, I do. Okay, so this will be number uh, number one right here. Okay. This will be number two. This will be number three. And this will be number four. Got it. Right? So imagine where it is. So yep. one, two, three, or four like this, right? Okay, yep. Look right here. Look right here. Right at me. Yep. Just count out loud from one to four. Don't give me a clue when you say the number you're thinking of. Okay. Go for it. One, two, three, four. <gasps> I know. <clears throat> it is not. It's not under... It's not under two. That was weird how you did that. It's not under two. Perfect. Okay. Wait, wait a minute. If he, if um, you, oh man. So okay. think about it again. Think about it again oh for me. Goodness. We've got one, three, and four. You got a number in mind, yes. right? So this is wait. one, this is three, and this is four right here. You know where it is. Yeah, yes? Have you ever guessed wrong? On this? Yes, this has absolutely gone wrong. Okay. <laughs> this is either a viral clip or a super viral clip. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Um, okay. Oh, not over here. Mark, seriously, you're scaring me now. I'm a little nervous. Val, you do the last one. No, you, no, 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 it's fine. It's fine. I, it's fine. Switch over here. Switch over here. No, I have an idea what Switch it is. Switch over here. No, no, no. Mm, okay. Just think about where it is. So okay. we've got this one or this one. Just okay. think. So we'll just do one and two now. This is one. This is two here. One and two. Just think. Okay. Okay, I can't. <sighs> no, seriously, I'm nervous. <sighs> yes! Oh! Yes! And it's a sharp spot. Yes, very good. Nice job. We did it. We How did, did you it. We do did it. Wait, do you have any scars on your hands? <laughs> one right here from a few years ago. Wow. That's pretty good. Look, wow, Val, I feel great. bad. I brought one other thing to show you because okay. I knew this is only reading Ryan's mind. So okay. let's try one last thing. And this is influencing the two of you at once. Okay. In my show, I read minds and I try to send people thoughts. So let's do that. I brought a couple okay. things here. This is a bit of a guess for today, right? It's April Fool's Day, but no no pranks, just okay. a, a guess for you here today. So I'll give that to you. And okay. if I grab a phone, someone had a phone over here. Could I grab it? Thank you. Thank you very much. Let's do it like this. Just going to use a calculator and we'll clear it out like this. So I'm going to try to influence some decisions here. So we'll start with Ryan. I need a single digit number. Okay. From one up to nine, name it now. Say okay, it out, out loud. loud. Seven. Seven. We'll type seven in just like so. We hit times and give me a two digit number. A two, 27. 27. We do 27 in like this and hit equals. Gives us the first number. Okay, so let's do a three digit number. You do the first one, just type it in. You Any have... three digits? No, just the first digit. You don't even have to say it. Type okay. it in. Okay. We'll keep it secret. You do the next one. 
and I'll do one as well. So we do this together, we hit equals, we're getting bigger, and let's do it one more time. We'll hit times, four digit number, two digits from you, two digits from you. So okay. you start, Okay. two digits, and two digits from you, and we'll hit equals just like this. Okay. That is quite a big number. Right. Get it right there. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Perfect. So, Val, I'm going to have you hold on to this. Would you hold okay. this for me? Yes. I'm just going to write this number here. So, would you read it a digit at a time so we have it? Okay. Go for it. Seven, eight, Seven, comma, eight one, comma, one, four, zero. One, four, zero. Comma, one, one, nine. One, one, nine? Like yes. that? Yes. Yep. Very good, very good. So train me, I'll set this here for just a moment. Okay. I made a prediction inside of this envelope and I think you'll find this fascinating. Hand that to Ryan because you're gonna help me with this, Val. Okay. This is something I think you will find really interesting. It's a scroll of paper with a guess of what I thought these numbers would be. I was trying to influence you to make some decisions for this. So hold right here, okay. I'll unroll. It says the number will be, and it's right there, 78,140,119. The number will be, Got to build suspense. <laughs> yes. The number will be there. It'll be right there on the pad in Ryan's house. Perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Come see the show. It's way better. No, 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 no. That's oh, not it. That's oh. not it. That's not it. No, no. I like that you were done. That's, yeah. No, no. It will be there, just okay. not there. Um, it'll be here. Val, stand, stand here and hold this. Let me grab okay. that from you. Ryan, look at this number. I think you'll find this interesting. It was in plain sight. I flashed that to you a second ago. So look right here. Um, what channel are we on? Seven. Seven. And uh, this is season number? Eight. Eight. And you're on weekdays at what time? 1 p.m. 1 p.m. And if you do check this out, you're watching today on April the 1st, 2019. That's the show and the exact date right there. That was pretty good, Mark. That's Mic drop. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Yeah. Good to see you. You are the best. Give me a hug. So oh, yes. Be sure to catch Mark at the Chicago Magic Lounge on Wednesdays at 7.30 p.m. starting this way. Good stuff, Mark, really.